Hey guys, what's going on? So, in today's video, I'm going to make you learn how to make your Facebook account completely private. So, for that, first of all, you need to open your Facebook account. So, if your Facebook is already downloaded, so then you simply have to go and um, open it. But if it isn't installed, then you have to go on uh, Play Store and you have to install it. In my phone, it has already been downloaded, so I'm just going to go and so. Uh, as I've opened uh, my Facebook, so first of all, uh, what I need to do is I have to um, three horizontal lines at the top uh, right corner. So I'm gonna click on them. So after I click on that, so I'm just uh, it is gonna take me to this page. So I'm not gonna see anything over there. I'm just gonna scroll down. And after as I scroll down, you can see there is an option called as privacy shortcuts, and I'm just simply, simply gonna click on privacy shortcuts. So as I click on privacy shortcuts, so now there are a ton of uh, other options and uh, pages over here. So what I need to do is I'm gonna go to that privacy icon, and over there I'm gonna tap on see more privacy settings. So as I click on that, now there are numerous options over here through which I can show you guys that you can change many, many options of your privacy. So the first is that how people can find and contact you. So uh, who can see your friend request? So you're going to tap on that. And after you, you tap on that, it's going to give you two options, everyone and friends of friends. So mine is already on the friends of friends, but if it is on everyone, you're simply going to switch it to friends of friends after that the next option is who can see your friend list so you're again again going to tap on that and now you're going to make it you're going to click on see more and you're going to click on only me okay so now it has all done so then you're going to mm, again uh, continue to the next one and you're going to again switch it to only me so you know you, you got the point right so you're going to just uh change all of its settings to only me and to the closest privacy settings so i'm just gonna do it uh, a little quickly so i'm just gonna turn all of them to only me i'm gonna change my birthday setting to only me you can see a birthday or only me and you see all of my setting has been changed so and i'm gonna go back okay there was another option over here which is limit who can see your posts also limit all posts and i'll click on confirm and then go back Okay, so as you guys saw that many of our uh, privacy settings has been done, but there are a few more things that you need to do to make your Facebook account completely private. So there is also a take a uh, privacy check it. So over here you can do this that you have to click who can see what see. Okay, so continue. So over here you see as you can see all of my things have already on the prior only me you're gonna click next and now there is default audience okay so you're gonna click on friends and then are you just gonna tap on only me in this way uh, some more things have been become private now stories now who can see your stories it has a uh, they're public but we have to change it I'm gonna click on public and then we're gonna click on custom which means that it will be uh, no one will see a story. I don't have any friends right now, so it is not showing me anything. You're just simply gonna save it. So you're gonna go back, and it will be no one will see your story. Okay, then you're gonna go back, and now limit your passwords, and it will limit all your passwords. Now you're again gonna click on next, and now it's simply blocking. You don't need to block anyone, so our account has been become private. Again, I'm gonna go back. So after you go back. Now you have to click on how to keep your account secure. So you're going to click on continue. Okay, so now we'll take you to a place where you can um, uh, turn on a list. Uh, to be very honest, uh, that is really not important. But if you would like to do that, then you can do this on your own things. And it's a uh, password. And you can also have an extra layer of security to your account if you want to. And it is called as a two-factor authentication. Um, I mean, this is not really important. But if you want to do that, you can do this also by clicking on the get started. I'm just going to go back okay so after you do this now you can uh, click on the third one that how people can find you on facebook so now continue 
Okay, so now they are giving you that who can send you the friend request. So you're gonna click over here. We have already uh, select the friends of friends. We're gonna go back. Then we're gonna go to the next. So it has only been only me, only me, and you know, these uh, settings have already been done. So we're gonna go back. Now your data settings on Facebook. I'm gonna click on my data settings on Facebook. So continue. Next. This has also been already done. So your ad preferences on Facebook. Now click on continue and next and then next okay so as you guys can see that all of our uh, privacy uh, arrangements has been done um other than that um i'm gonna do one more thing that is i'm gonna go again on the facebook on the two lines then i'm gonna click on settings and privacy and from there i'm gonna click on settings okay so as i come over here so i'm gonna scroll down and after i scroll down i'm gonna click on followers and public content okay so over here uh, there are few more options that you can uh, perform uh, to uh, make your account private so the first thing is that who can follow me so you don't have to uh, click on public you're gonna switch it to friends then you're gonna uh, public post comments you're again gonna click on friends of friends so then public post notifications you can turn it to no one and then it is public profile info like if you don't want anyone to see your profile info you're gonna make it to, uh, you're gonna select friends you saw that our settings have been updated and i um i um show you guys that every single thing on your facebook has become private and now your account has completely been private so if this video helped you out and if it was useful let me know in the comment section below also do not forget to like share and subscribe to my channel um, because it really helps my channel to grow so i would really appreciate that if you do that so i'll meet you guys in the next video till then take care